this is problem right here the question is asking given a is 1 4 1 1 and lambda is 1 is equal to 3 lambda 2 is equal to minus 1 find v1 and v1 and v2 so if you say th this these are my eigenvalues and this is my uh, they are asking to find the eigenvectors so let's see how we can find this so first of all for this kind of question what we do is we set this a minus lambda i a general form equal to 0 it's a null space so this is how we begin this question for this uh, this a it's 2 by 2 matrix therefore the identity uh, of this one is going to be something like this 1 0 0 1 and if you multiply by this one by lambda you will get lambda 0 0 lambda so you simply subtract this one from the a right so when you subtract you will get 1 minus lambda 1 minus lambda and 1 here and 4 1 minus lambda because these are the only things that have lambda so when I deduct these are the only things that's going to be deducted and let's begin with the lambda 1 is equal to 3 so if I take lambda 1 is equal to 3 and if I substitute this one so I'm setting this to in, this into null space so it should be 0 into the other side then here if I substitute this value here it's going to be 1 minus 3 1 4 1 minus 3 and uh, after I find the value so it's going to be minus 2 1 4 minus 2 and after I find the value I have to do the ghost Jordan so if I, if I do the ghost Jordan if you see if I multiply this one by 2 and add it to the second equation this both will become 0 because if, if I multiply this one it will become negative 4 this will become 2 and 2 plus minus 2 0 negative 4 plus 4 is 0 so let's see minus 2 1 0 and this is going to be so I multiply the first equation by 2 to r1 plus r2 that's give us 0 0 right here so from now on I, I know this is my free variable because this is my pivot therefore this is going to be my free variable so free variable and if I simplify this one more to Gauss Jordan so I have to make this one equal to 1 so what I have to do is I have to divide by negative 2 so if I divide this one by negative 2 I will get 1 right here and if I divide this one by negative 2 I will get negative half so 0 0 and here it's become 0 0 now I can create my equation so the equation is going to be x uh, x minus half y so I set this one as x so this this one's y equal to 0 so from this one because I have to write everything in terms of free variables so y is my free variable free variables y so I have to write both of them in terms of y so in this case x is going to be equal to half y therefore we can say uh, the vector so we let's say this is v1 right v1 is equal to half y comma y y is my free variable so it's going to be itself then what I have to do is I can take the y common here so it's going to be half comma y uh, half comma one and then uh, I can write this one as span of half comma one so this is my eigenvector for the lambda one is equal to three now I have to find the eigenvector when lambda two is equal to minus one so let's see it's going to be same thing lambda two is equal to minus one in this case what we have to do is we, instead of lambda we plug the minus one value so let's see so one minus minus one and then here one it's going to be four right here it's going to be one minus minus one and we set to set this one into null space so it's going to be zero zero in this side and this is going to be two one this is going to be four this is going to be two and other side is going to be zero zero so in this case if you see this one uh, if i multiply the first equation by negative two and add it to the second equation the second equation will become zero therefore let's do this one so i'm doing i'm doing the ghost chart on here so two one so if you multiply the first equation by the negative 2 it's going to become negative 2 r1 plus r2 that will give us 0 in the bottom therefore this is going to be 0 0 then what I can do is I, I have to more simplify this we know this is going to be my free variable because this is my pivot right here but uh, I had to fully do the ghost Jordan so let's see so if I want to make this one into ghost Jordan pattern I have to make this one 1 so to do that I have to divide by 2 so it's going to be 1 and this is going to be 1 by 2 and this is 0 this is 0 on the other side is going to be 0 0 
then if I now I can create the equation and now I, I, I also know that this is my free variable because this is my pivot this does, this uh, column doesn't have pivots therefore this is my free variable therefore we know the y is our free variable y is free variable therefore let, we have to give the answers in terms of y so let's create the equation x plus half y is equal to 0 therefore x is going to be equal to minus half y therefore we, we can write the vector v2 is equal to minus half y comma y and then I can take the y common if I take the y common it's going to be minus half comma 1 and I can write this one as span of minus half 1 so these are my final answer so v1 is this and v2 is equal to this value and that's how it's done I hope you guys like this video see you next time